Hello everyone! In today's Bring a Trailer overview I have another, another beauty, SL55. It is a low mileage car, 21,000 miles on the clock. Believe me, it's very low. This is an early, early model SL. Uh, it's 2003. I don't know when it was made, maybe in 2003, maybe in 2002, but it's almost a 20 year old car and just 21,000 miles. On average, it was driven like a mile, no, 1,000 miles a year, just 1,000 mile, miles a year. It's extremely low. And this car is very beautiful. It has silver exterior. It is called Brilliant Silver Metallic Exterior. There are different uh, silver colors uh, in there. There were, there, there were different, I mean, there, there were a few different silver colors. One of them is this Brilliant Silver. Uh, and it has very nice rims. It has two-tone uh, interior, red leather with a uh, black dashboard and uh, wood, uh, I don't know how this uh, wood is called. Uh, let's see if they have a description here. Uh, wood, 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 wood. I don't see, I mean, uh, I don't want to spend a lot of time searching, but anyway, I will show you some pictures later. Only 21,000 miles, two owners, 38 service records. I mean, this car is beautiful, low mileage, uh, probably in great shape. Uh, I see the seller said that uh, the hinge cover has been replaced because on the pictures there you can you can see it like a hole on the driver's side like on my car there is a hole currently and it was replaced and let's check the latest comment okay this car is a beast i know all you bidders current and potential have a final price in their head be bold let's knock it out the park all right uh it means bid hard and continue bidding. $25,000 and $555. I think this is not the end. Uh, there are, there is, we have like less than a day, uh, 19 hours left to go. I guess this car can touch $30,000, but we'll see. I don't want to speculate. I don't like to speculate on the price because market will always decide, not me, but market. I don't like to say that hey it's a steal or it's a fair price or it's like overpriced uh i think it can touch 30 but we'll see maybe more maybe less uh the good thing about this car it's it has extremely low miles just two owners it means this car wasn't uh flipped uh, and uh, you know like the more owners you have typically it means the next owner i mean you can run easily into this situation where the next owner uh they purchased the car they enjoyed it for one year or two years they did nothing about uh fixing things they just uh got the car they bought the car as is and they sold it in the same condition so it's great that the current owner replaced uh, that hinges and uh, flaps and uh, it may be in very, I mean, in great condition. I don't know. I didn't check, actually. Uh, let's check the pictures. Uh, SL, uh, Bruno Sacco, the designer, the chief designer who designed this car. Of course, it was a teamwork, but... Uh, when we say SL, we remember uh, the name of their head designer at that time. Very, very, very beautiful car from uh, different 
angles. I cannot say the same thing about uh, a few other Mercedes vehicles, but this car is very beautiful from this angle, from this angle. Uh, the only thing uh, I um, sometimes I don't understand is the interior of their headlights, because as you can see, there is only like half of the uh, uh, headlight is filled with some construction which is like perforated i mean if you don't pay attention to such details this car is like like 10 out of 10 it's super beautiful uh okay let's continue this angle this angle as well this and rear quad exhaust tips boy you will hear that v8 sound the cold start is typical for v8 uh, the supercharger whining it's typical for supercharged vehicles then when you floor it you will hear it it will open up and it will sound very aggressive very very nice car from every angle and now the uh, top is closed. As you can see, it doesn't have a glass panoramic uh, roof. The roof is solid. That's what I can see from here. Again, these wheels, very simple and very beautiful. Multi-spoke, I don't know how, my, how many spokes are here, maybe 20, uh, very thin very elegant wheels personally i prefer uh five spoke wheels from sl65 but this these rims are like number two and they are beautiful i think if i could have five spoke and this that will be that would be great and since it's sl55 it has a sporty exterior uh, it's not your typical sl 500 uh, this is a sports car let's check interior yeah i mean i can look at these pictures and i see the seller did lots of pictures and from every angle this car is beautiful with top down with top up i mean just look at these proportions uh it's i could place this picture on my desktop and make it a background because i really like this car the silver it's my favorite colors of sl and few other mercedes-benz vehicles very nice it has parking sensors very nice rims very very nice rims this car uh, is not equipped with a p30 package uh, because you would quickly notice the difference because the front bumper would be different it would be like uh, from sl65 so many nice pictures here so many nice pictures and i really appreciate uh, the quantity and the quality of them because they are close-ups when you bid uh, on an, on the auction just like bring a trailer sometimes you don't you cannot see the car sometimes you can be like far away from the car and close-up pictures can tell you a lot about the car again no glass roof uh, some uh, people like it some prefer uh, the solid roof because uh, the glass roof it still uh, doesn't uh, I have glass roof on my car and sometimes under some angles you can uh, have the sun lights coming through that top shade 
and it it's I mean it's not great uh, ideally I would like to have a very solid uh, roof when I need it but it is what it is this car is great uh, I, 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 it has Killy's go option based on what I see and uh, like Killy's entry Killy's go compressor and here is how the top is being uh, put in, into the trunk all right so interior very nice two-tone uh, car so it has red seats uh, black dashboard and uh, black center console and some wood and uh, everything else is red which is beautiful I mean uh, some cars they only have like let's say like red seats red something but Mercedes they have red everything uh, below the dashboard that's beautiful this is the early model and look at this tiny screen this is the signature uh, signature screen of all early model mercedes-benz vehicles like early 2000s uh, i'm not a big fan of it but still i see what it is you can uh, update it with a bigger screen with android screen it's a bit pain in the butt to update it with Android, but people did it before, and I'm in the process of upgrading my uh, CLS 55 screen, which is bigger by default, uh, but it's still dated, uh, very dated. All right, so this car is not equipped with a P50 package, and by the way, these small screens on my car I need to replace them on this car everything is still like it's supposed to be very nice very clean screens small displays I can still see all the information and this is just reflection on the right as you can see a yeah, reflection and now there is no reflection and uh, this car is not equipped with a very uh, expansive option which was called uh designio designio package if it had designio package it you will quickly notice that the difference here on the dashboard uh, on the dashboard the leather or it's vinyl i don't know it's uh, uh, it has this uh, grainy pattern uh, and when you have designio leather uh, it's smooth uh, and very nice so I prefer Designia but uh, only few SLs SL55 vehicles they were equipped with Designia option as you can see the grainy leather continues here and uh, but it's not big deal I mean the famous cup holders man I wish Mercedes uh, had done better job in the early 2000s um, I drive, I daily drive 2500 minivan Odyssey. It has four cup holders in between the seats, the front seats, and here it's very unique creation of Mercedes-Benz designers and engineers. Uh, but it's better than nothing. Again, this start-stop engine button. Uh, my SL is not equipped with this option, and I have to insert the key and to use the key to start my SL and here it's just very easy you just press the brake press the button and it's done as you can see there is some wood here but uh, this uh, reflection it's like this picture was done under the direct sunlight so it's difficult to tell I don't remember the color of this wood uh, it's like dark that's like dark like uh, yellowish color color I would say the car is super clean super nice these seats sometimes the leather on uh, 
the leather here it's scratched sometimes even torn but this is low mileage car the leather looks very nice so you don't have to open the door and then oh my god the seat is so worn it's in great shape i guess yeah i like these red carpets everywhere sl55 on the carpet yeah very nice car grainy doors because no designia but uh, it's not big deal uh, designia is a very rare package not many owners uh, optioned their cars with designia and uh, it is what it is so we are at picture number 187 so the car is very clean I don't see like a single scratch inside or outside maybe there are some small maybe not I don't know Alcantara uh, headliner I have glass and I have different I have uh, I don't have this in my car oops the internet is a bit slow if you buy this car you will definitely enjoy it because it looks beautiful and it's very important because uh, I noticed it's great when you can approach your car from the distance and if you like your car you will enjoy it even before you enter your car then if the weather is nice, if you are driving not on the interstate or like high speed road, uh, or if you're driving through the like low speed country road or through the city uh, where you don't have lots of like uh, exhaust gases and other stuff, like small city, you can. Uh, put the top down and enjoy the sun just make sure you are wearing a hat or a baseball cap otherwise uh, this area will suffer from may suffer from the sun or and your neck uh, but I, I, I'm just I maybe I shouldn't say this but uh, I, I, I know I mean how it is when you drive it for a while under the direct sun in summer you have to put some sunscreen like cream on on your head on your face just to be safe uh, and when you start it you will hear its typical v8 cold start and then supercharger whining and then you will leave your parking space and drive where you need to go uh, where you need to drive and you will enjoy this car every single moment yeah m113k engine this car has 500 horsepower and i don't remember how many like pounds feet of torque but it doesn't matter because this car is super fast uh, what I can say is that uh, this car needs nothing you don't have to I mean honestly uh, you can but you don't have to upgrade the supercharger pulleys to make it even more powerful like uh, people do this but you don't have to Sandro Sandro something tells me it's maybe it's different Sandro uh, maybe it's the famous engine builder uh, from AMG I don't remember I don't want to speculate here very nice uh, oops I see another car looks like a Mini Cooper or something uh, very nice very clean I don't see anything criminal here I don't see any leaks if you need to check this car like thoroughly you may uh even uh, inspect every underbody picture uh just zoom in and 
check it check it out three keys it's great vmi i won't go through this vmi because it will take forever so we are back at the picture number one and what i can say great car looks i mean amazing one of the best mercedes-benz vehicles ever made besides those cars that like black series like uh race cars like clk gtr uh, those cars are in their own league but this is a car that was available for public you don't have to be a special person you don't you i mean you uh not you don't not don't have you i mean by the by the uh, i mean when this car was available when it was still available it was uh available for everyone and uh every rich person could buy this car brand new uh beautiful car beautiful rims very nice color combination silver and red uh, early model uh most likely fixed everything already uh, the seller mentioned it in comments and uh, uh, most likely it's been serviced well so and low miles very low miles 21,000 miles i mean you can buy this car and probably you wouldn't have to worry about anything for a few years but again if you want to resell it later you may not even uh, invest uh, like a dollar in its like repairs or like something so very nice car very beautiful i like a sales uh let's read this comment from uh jorian 22 i own this uh, exact spec spec car year color and i can tell you this is a monster uh the red interior is eye-catching and no one ever believes me when i tell them it's age exactly this car aged well there are some mercedes-benz vehicles that i personally believe they didn't age well this car did um, on the road it looks like a brand new vehicle oh and it's freaking rocket ship no matter the speed you're going punching it always throws you back into the seat just a monster monster of a car i totally agree so we have 25 grand and less than 19 hours in this auction so whoever wins this car will get a great car and they will love it so good luck and i hope you can get your dream mercedes-benz your dream sl thank you for watching and i see you in my next one